Hey, Destiny, how you doing? Oh, here comes Key. So today we're going to go in the van, in the, the four-wheel drive just there. We're going to go f about an hour in before we then uh, get out and walk. And then today we're going to walk from where we are now to 2,500. Tomorrow, 2,500 to 3,500. And then in two nights' time, we do summit night up there. We're going to go from 3,500 to 4,500. You can maybe just see the little crest of Miru there somewhere, just behind those clouds. So we got, gonna jump in the four wheel drive, capture uh, some nice shots of some animals as we go, hopefully. And then we are out walking. Okay, day one, we're in the Jeep. We're driving about an hour to from 1,500 to 2,500. We've got animals. We've got buffalo. We've got warthogs here. we got monkey, yeah, in the tree just there. So we're gonna go from 1,400 to 25 today. Tomorrow, we go 25 to 35. After that night, we go 35 to 4,500, which is the summit, then all the way back down. Look at you. Yeah, where are you heading from? He's gonna place it open or shoot it. That is, that's really cool. <laughs> okay, right, Mamela Gate. We've just had lunch. We've driven here in the car uh, about an hour from the main gate of the National Park. We are at uh, about 1500. We're gonna go now, hike up three or four hours up to about 2500 for our first camp. All right, we're off, we're going. Sean, Destiny, Nick, Julius, the guide. Yo, yo, Jumbo, Jumbo. We got Charlie and Charlie's guide. And we're going that way. Before you were 16 kilometers. So after 15. Destiny, one minute, you're on the road looking at the scenery. So it's going to be like this, three, four, the fourth one, then there is empty space mm -hmm. because one bullet is missing. Right. So this cooking handle will gonna pass free. So nothing in the chamber. Mm -hmm. So my gun is safe like this. So if, if there is danger case, I need to load it fast. That's one right there.
Yes. Red ants trade. Mm. Yeah, so they they transferring eggs. And they're heading right for from you. queen side. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> Hey, the boys, go the boys. <laughs> You brother? Yeah, okay, we just got to camp, uh, Milia Kamba camp. Miru is up there. Uh, we went from the park gate at 1.5 and we're here at like 2495 or 2500 meters. It's a good day, about four and a half hours. Um, I'll spin around and show you the view out this way. Uh, Myself, Nick, Destiny, Sean, made it in good time. And now we're gonna grab some food, uh, have a little wash, grab dinner, and then tomorrow morning we'll wake up, we'll go from here, we'll go to about three, five, and a small little acclimatization hike tomorrow morning. <laughs> Serious stuff this. Yep. So we had 93 and 18. Yeah, that's fine. There we go, let's go back down. Wim Hof. It's about 6 a.m. Morning, day two. One of the best things about going to the mountains is waking up before the sunrise. So the sun is just coming up, it's just hitting Miru. That's Miru there, that's the ash cone there. But if I spin around, that's the sunrise coming up over Kilimanjaro. So on the right hand side there, you got Mwenzi. Then we got Kibo in the middle, the taller of the three. And then on the left, the little bump is Shira. So that's Kilimanjaro, the sun's coming up. We're just above the clouds. This is going 6 a.m. on day two. This is where we're going tomorrow night. Say that's you. Hey, whoop, whoop, whoop. So, this is Saddle Hut Camp. Saddle Hut Camp, 3,500 meters. Jumbo, Jumbo. Oh, 
Oh, it's not far off from there. Boom. Yeah, that's easy, easy, isn't it? it was 48 minutes. 48 minutes, what do you mean? Okay. Let's go. All right, we've just done our acclimatization trip from 35 to 3,800. We've just got to Little Maru. It's 3,820. 3, Beautiful views behind us. And then up to a bit you can see just on the clouds, that's the ridge we're going to take up to the summit. It goes off up that way tomorrow behind those clouds further up. So our camp is there. So we'll go from the camp up to that first bump. You can see that's Rhino Point. That'll probably still be dark by the time we get there. And then we'll go on up to the summit in the dark, in the cold tomorrow morning. But yeah, I'm just going to pose for a few photographs here with the gang. And then we'll uh, head back down and grab some food and go to bed. <laughs> the look of uh, trauma is still there in the Washy washy after pooey pooey. <laughs> so tell us about your, your poo, Nick. <laughs> I don't want to relive the experience. <laughs> well, we'll talk about it over dinner. Then. Oh, yes. Okay, we've just done our final day before summit night tonight. Uh, we went from 2.5 to 3.5. We had lunch. We had quite a long, we did that quite fast. We did it in like four, three hours, 45, 50 minutes. Um, so we actually had a lot of time this afternoon. We had some lunch, we had a nap, uh, and then we did our climatization hike from that up to Little Miru at 3,800, came back down. We've just had dinner. We've got our things ready for summit night. I'll give you a quick tour of the room. This is my quarters here. Let me get the light. This is my spot here. We got Nick there. We got Sean up there. And we got our spare spot up there. So we got everything ready to go for tonight. We're going to wake up uh, about midnight. Um, food at half 12. And then we are going to the summit. Okay, it's summit night now. We're just up. We're just getting some food. It's not too cold out. It's about 10 past 12. Didn't sleep at all. Last night, really. Um, I was just lying awake. We went to bed about 7 o'clock. Checked my phone about 10 o'clock. It was still wide awake. Two hours to go. But we're here now. We're ready to go. We're about to get some breakfast, some coffee, some tea. Maybe some porridge, I don't know. And then we're on our way. It's a still night. The weather's not too bad. So, uh, yeah. Wish me luck. Here we go. Okay. You see the screen? Sean and Nick are there sorting their stuff out. We've been gone for two hours. Everyone's doing great. We had a nice little steep walk across the chain. 
We are now probably two hours away from daylight, maybe a bit more, more. and we're about 3,900 and something. All going well, hopefully see you at the top. Yes, brother. Good, my brother. Very good, man. Oh, I have to get on the side. You see, wherever you want, pal. Good job, guys. Summit of Mount Maru. All right, we did it. That was tough. Yes, good shot of you. Man, it's up, Mount Four thousand five hundred sixty-six. Hey, too much easy. Rahisi Kinoma. Only two hours since that last video where the sun came. What time is it now? Seven. Seven oh six. Seven oh six. Yeah, fifty-four minutes to eight according to Destiny. What you guys? The best, <laughs> the very best. Comments. What comments do you say? Everybody say, Pura Vira! Pura Vira! Awesome job. You did it. Amazing. Okay. Thank Okay, so just got back down to uh, Milia Kamba Hut, the first camp we were at. Miria Kamba, that's how you say it. We just walked about two hours down, 
uh, three hours fifty to go up. We're absolutely exhausted. Um, we are uh, gonna sneakily gonna jump in there because one of the guys is carrying some knocks on his legs. We have the ambulance down to the park gate. About forty five minutes, thankfully. back at the hotel now uh, it's the morning after that Hamelin's journey was very bumpy very uncomfortable we did about 45 minutes down this jungle road I got a bit of bad head sorry just out of bed um, we did 45 minutes down this bumpy jungle road off road nothing to hold on to bouncing around it was quite the experience I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend that a walk would have been better but today so today's actually the morning after um, everyone's doing great just right now getting some hydration salts in and coffee. Today is actually the day before and the morning after because tomorrow, well today we've got a crew coming in, Kilimanjaro Airport, and tomorrow we're gonna go do Kilimanjaro. So there'll be a whole other video on that sometime very soon, so keep an eye out. Thank you very much.